<laughs> They're the ones who should be arresting, not me. Why didn't you say that before? What we got here? Cam, this is William Klein. He was wrecking an office. But I, I just wanted to meet them face to face. I, I wanted them to admit what they were doing. Who is they? He was in the office of the Trilateral Commission. The Trilateral Commission? Yeah, the Trilateral Commission. <laughs> All right, what is the Trilateral Commission? <laughs> it's an organization founded in 1973 by David Rockefeller to bring together business and political leaders from the United States, Europe, Japan, so they could work together for uh, better economic and political cooperation between their nations. And with that, that's what they'd like us to believe. But you see, what they're really up to is a scheme to plant their own loyal members in positions of power in this country, to work to erase national boundaries and create an international community, and in time, bring about a one-world government with David Rockefeller calling the shots. I take it they're pressing charges? Yeah, well, uh, uh, he broke a globe and, uh, and some UNICEF artwork. Well, they're in on it, too. Okay, Mr. Klein, if you're just... I'm telling you, our whole way of life as we know it is in jeopardy. I appreciate that information. But I, 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 have, the, I have the documented evidence. It's all in there. Show him. Well, he's got, um, got these magazines here. Conspiracy Review. Suppressed Truth Roundup. The whole master plan is exposed. Yeah, well, um... You're still not convinced, huh? <laughs> would, would you like to hear the names of just a few of the people who have been on the Trilateral Commission? Uh, not particularly. James no. Earl Carter. Heard of him? Look, Mr. Klein... Henry Kissinger. You heard of him? Walter Mondale. Who? <laughs> Mr. Klein, this is... John all... Anderson. George Bush. Now, you remember at the, at the convention, everybody thought it was going to be Ford for Veep. You know what happened? David Rockefeller just picked up a phone, put in a call. Hey, Ronnie, forget Jerry, it's George. Bye. <laughs> so, no matter who won in November, they had their man in the White House. Are you through? 